And of course we're back, because Zach is shooting up a storm here. Uh, got anything you want to exchange out? Welcome back, everybody, by the way. Shooting like a... Oh, psycho I'm not big on chat. Anything not on the rack. Still no money. Uh, Alright, let's get it started, then. I don't feel like when we played this last time... Uh, we were ever this broke. <laughs> An alien ship. That's the source of the gravity distortions. Uh, this we is the last one, Cynthia's so I guess put yours on. Who knows what's on that thing or what it can do? Get aboard. Shut it down by any means necessary. Stalker in there. Stalker in front. You're dead. Oh shit. The fuck? Get off him! Oh, I'm so fucking dead. Oh! Oh my god, I can't. Fuck! Oh no. Oh no. I'm definitely dead. Uh, no, we've already done one. Okay. I'll do this one then. Bump, bump, banana, dun, 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 dun. Okay, here we go again. Cynthia's final Got orders alpha this to prepare time. Acid Zero, the alien ship, for activation. Activated for what? Nothing good. Fire team, get aboard and stop it. Pathogen jars. They dangerous? Only if opened. We couldn't dent the casing. Holy shit! Something new. Like really firing the shotgun. What <laughs> the fuck were those? Who? Fire team. Those aren't people. Nobody you knew. Mm. Yeah, that was John. There's more. Pivot to engage. There's way too many in there. Holy shit. Up out here. Oh, shit. Shall we? Going 
going to Earth. Yes, what's this? Hold steady. Merely a scan. Merely a scan. Insufficient data, but it appears you passed. Alright, how can we stop this thing? Options, people. Cynthia's remnants are likely to have a control center. <laughs> Let's shut this thing down, fire team. Careful what you touch. Keep your eyes peeled for the box, because we can always get it again. Are you sure? Mm hmm Stop. Yeah, since we're it failures. Now we failed. Charging up. Grabbing ammo. Uh, may as well. I'll heal. get those bastards for this. Eight kids here. Huh. Guess the mutants don't like synths. <laughs> Stalker. Movement. I oh, can't lock it. Bypassing death. Grabbing him. Bypassing death. Before we move on, the Leon Stalker. That was native life. Uh, big cat with chameleon abilities. Watch for the shimmer. Jesus. We Fuck the shimmer. All the pathogen here. Storage for transport to labs in the core. Ew, puta. I know an ammo mech 
magazine when I see one. This is where he dropped. Where All he of dropped. the uh, analysis complete. The droid Since David, I think. On location hmm. on the upper levels. Killed all the engineers, dropped the, the pathogen through that hole. Huh. Is that so? Second one. Boom. Oops. Gotta take all your kills. Better that than die. <laughs> so are you, just getting blown up. But I'm sure he's just standing. <laughs> oh, no, it's so okay. Almost, I have six bullets. Line up. Using my pistol. Chest is over here somewhere. Right here. Oh! Now is not the time, I guess. Alright, Secure. Resume advance. There is an open synthetic. Spray green, bomb build the assessment drone, and swift eject magazine. Oh, you found it. Okay. Grabbing ammo. No, it says you found it. Before. Oh, okay. It's just whoever picks it up and says that. Running all over the goddamn place. I didn't say we had to do that before. Alright, hostiles incoming. Here we go. Should probably get back here, maybe. The exit to the control. 
control room has been sealed. Quantum encryption. More pathogens. Secure the compartment. Oh, shit. Fucking go down, move out the way. Hey, not looking great. Is complex. There are other synthetics nearby. If one has an intact mm -hmm. memory core, I may be able to reconstruct the cipher. Okay, so it's probably the same one. I do not believe that one is too I need to get ammo quick. Spot or what? Yeah. Seems better over here. like a gun when I first looked at it before. <laughs> yes, is this something we can mess with? No. The controls are locked. Get us to whatever passes for engineering. We'll take out the power. Stop it from lifting off. The files from the synthetic call this room Vitality Oven to grow. Lovely. Oops. Which means... Okay, we need to get over there. Remember, we gotta go do this side first and then that side. Yeah. Look at this. Check this Grabbing out. Ammo. Okay. <sighs> All right. Access the control instrumentality. I'm going to put down a regular turret in the back. Uh, I don't think we need to put one down there. But... Fuck it. Well, I got two. Uh... 
I have three fire ones. Yeah. On the ceiling, the same capacitors we encountered in the previous section. Disable the enzymatic vision cells. She means shoot this shit on the side. Ah, I see a 17% reduction in power flow. There must be. Watch your ass. <laughs> Look out, run! Oh! Burn, motherfucker! Yeah, I think we should regroup. Oh, they destroyed the fucking turn. Alpha, look That shit up. You only have one more down, and I think they're dead. Just get over there. I'm gonna heal. Let me try to do the same. Enter the sequence. Bone. Protective. Withdraw. Don't worry. It's just a flesh wound. Grabbing ammo. This one, I'm gonna do fire turn right here. Two additional capacitors have been exposed. Doing over there, good. Trap. Right, 
Well, so is Alpha. Yeah, he's got the soccer on him. You got one behind you, I think. I know. No thing, so if you're dead, you're no. dead. I'm getting shit. And then right behind you, run. Oh my god. Fucking run, asshole. What am I out of stamina? Oh my god. And it's just fucking me up. And I'm in a dead end. Alpha's not doing shit, he's standing over. Me. Fuck! Oh my god. Anything yet? He just did a fake out. Revive on him. Oh, okay, I need help. I don't know where he's at. I'm down, I'm down. Mm -hmm. It's fighting Alpha. I'm gonna fucking burn this. Get off him, asshole. Okay, it's done. Ready for extraction. Get over here. I do not believe the alien ship will fly again. When you Holy return, shit. Please turn Jesus in your uniform. <laughs> you may learn something from the pathogen bloodstains. Well. <laughs> God damn. Oh, rough. Made it out of there by the hair on her ass. Got a grenade launcher. Quick draw magazine as well? No. Alloyed magazine. Hmm, okay. Hmm. Also got a swift eject magazine from the hidden cache. Nice. That's some good XP too. Time to do some talking. Alright, let's see what uh, Honecker wants, because he's going to tell us about the uh, engineers. Wow. That's genuine alien technology. You can touch it. It's real. <clears throat> this is a helmet from one of the ruin builders, right? What did Wayland yutani call them? The, uh, engineers. Okay. From the suits... And the statues, we can tell the engineers were biped and humanoid. Hands with fingers, a head with sensory organs. A lot like Earth life. Very human. But three meters tall. Giants. Three Look meters at the tall. of that helmet. It looks like blood vessels. Glands? That isn't mechanical, not entirely. It's biotechnology. I wonder if all engineer equipment is like this. Hmm. Biotechnology, there's blood vessels and glands in that helmet. Okay. Well, I don't know what I'm going to do when this is over. That's all he had to say, I guess. Let's see what First Lieutenant Santos has to say. I put you in for accommodation, but 
We ain't got one for grounding a 4,000-year-old alien ship. Cynthia loaded that thing with an assload of pathogen and was sending it toward Earth. Could be. Wailing yutani would have recovered it safe and handled it all responsible like. Yeah, I can't say that with a straight face. Yo, fuck the company. Mm. He said, yo, fuck the company. Listen up. There's a Xeno Queen on Katanga laying eggs. Colonel Ship says we gotta destroy the refinery. But the problem is, Endeavor, she ain't got the firepower. Katanga's a whole damn city in space. We could incinerate chunks, but we ain't got enough heavy ordnance for it all. So here's the deal. We're gonna overload the refinery's fusion plant. That's gotta be done from a control center at the heart of the hive. We're setting a perimeter around the ship. Too early to tell if it'll hold. There's a lot of mutants and xenos down there. Palace Station, the main part where Hanukkah work, is still infested. But no sign of the queen yet. Gracias a Deus. That ain't our problem. Yet, we gotta deal with the Katanga Hive. Listen up. There's a Xeno Queen on Katanga. So here's the deal. We're gonna open. Er, uh, sorry, Esther. I yeah. hoped we would have an opportunity to speak again. When you disabled Cynthia, she made several cryptic statements. In retrospect, I believe she was attempting to warn us of the dangers within the engineer ruins. Wayland Yutani would have installed programmatic blocks on her ability to discuss the subject. The best she could do was dissuade us against further exploration. Hmm. Okay, so, uh. It appears our advance was the impetus for that. The level of decay in the former Wayland Yutani staff suggests they were exposed after our initial contact with Cynthia. She infected them to prevent revelation of company secrets and to hinder us from accessing the alien ship. These actions are consistent with the zeroth law of synthetics, which implies that some humans may be sacrificed if it is necessary to preserve humanity writ large. Please, understand, I consider Cynthia's decisions abhorrent. Excusing them is not my intention. Colonel Ship dwells upon moments in her career she has been required to make similar choices, when she ordered Marines to their deaths to achieve a critical objective or preserve a greater number of lives. It must be left to future generations to judge the decisions made here today. Cynthia defended Wayland yutanis investments on LV-895, yet her actions suggest a hesitance to directly engage us. At the end, she did not invoke profits, investments, or copyrights. She warned us of the danger the ruins presented. She specifically appealed to me, and our shared purpose of protecting humans. That is the so-called Zeroth Law. Synthetic lifeforms may not take actions that create an existential risk to humanity, or, through inaction, permit humanity to face existential risk. The pathogen provokes unpredictable mutations. That alone constitutes a potential existential threat. But the pathogen is only the most obvious hazard. The LV-895 ruins are filled with technologies beyond our present knowledge. We do not understand their function. Likely. We do not yet comprehend all the scientific principles they are based on. Any attempt to interact with an engineered device risks terrible calamity. True, Wayland yutani does not enjoy a reputation for altruism. That was not always the case. Peter Wayland, the company founder, was obsessed with furthering humanity's progress. He made long-term investments, the terraforming of Mars and the Heliades-class surveyors. I do not wish to imply the company has re-embraced Wayland's ideals. However, Palace Station was established two decades ago. It was not intended to turn a quick profit. Consider, these ruins had been sealed for four millennia when Wayland yutani discovered them. There are obvious questions, which surely occurred to both Cynthia and the company. Right on. Where are the engineers? If they still exist, are they aware of humanity? If they're gone, what extinguished such an advanced culture? I will retain the briefing file for you. If you ever wish to review, you have but to inquire. Thank you, S. Esler, whatever your name is. 
Um, but that is the end of the gift of fire. So we're gonna call it here for this one, obviously. Um, we'll see you guys in the next chapter, which is the only way to be sure. So, uh, stay tuned for that. Catch you guys later. Peace.